we sit at the table, our family's heads bowed low. My thoughts return to childhood and the finest man I know. He doesn't speak good English. He's just a simple man. But when he's talking to the Lord, even a little child can understand. Now, I was young and reckless, but the thought still comes to me. About the day when I told my dad I felt I was old enough to leave. He sat there at the table, and a look came on his face. And he never spoke another word until he said, the table breaks. He said, our gracious Heavenly Father, we're all gathered here today to give thee thanks for blessing. Now my oldest son is leaving, Lord, and I guess he knows what's best. But just in case, could you stand beside and help him stand the test? Now he's awful neglectful about church on Sunday morning. And if he gets with the wrong crowd, would you take him by the arm? If he flies too high, would you clip his wings? But don't let him fall too hard, Lord. Sure, you can handle things. I've tried my best from day to day to teach him right from wrong. And he's grown to be a fine young man. And he's always blessed our home. We pray thee, Lord, for guidance that he won't build upon the sands. But we won't worry half as much if we know he's in your hands. And oh, yes, Lord, it won't be long till. I'll be coming home. Don't make me wait too long. We pray thee, Lord, for guidance to cleanse us from our sins so we can all be together in heaven. In Jesus' name, amen. We sat there at the table as tears ran down my face. And from that day on, I based my life on Father's table grace.